Right, so here we go. Time for more matches. All right, will we continue our good form? It's just got better and better since we actually started. By that I mean, well, um, it, it got better after we got fourth and third in our first two games. It's always got better. Like, I, I was getting warmed up. Like I said, I was warming up in my first video, but um, my second one, yeah, I decided to turn things up and decide to get the Ws. What I want to do is gather more Ws before the end of the day. We're still playing this on the 30th, and um, this will be... Um, I'll do a bit more sessions for the 30th, and then more on the um, final day. Of course, by the time this one probably goes up, it's going to be April Fool's, because I said two matches per video, so um, I'm going to still stand by that format. And um, yeah, this is going to be an April Fool's special. Will Mario be dead on this day, as Twitter has been joking about um, before the 31st hit? On the 30th, everyone's like, um, the 31st, Mario dies once it hits midnight. I know it's a joke. Of course it's a joke. A lot of um, Twitter does like to make jokes because Nintendo's taken down a lot of games, actually. This is one of the games that they're discontinuing. Then there's going to be the Game & Watch Mario version. Then there's going to be Mario 3D All-Stars taken down and Fire Emblem, actually. Which uh, many people completely are skipping because most of um, the thing that's happening is Mario related. So yeah, Fire Emblem's going too. Good thing I bought two of those things, which is um, 3D, 3D All-Stars and um, Fire Emblem. Fire Emblem was rather cheap, so I just bought it because I love Fire Emblem. <laughs> so yeah, um, wow, everybody died so quickly, what the hell? It looks like I'm about to die there, actually. But yeah, everybody died so quickly. Look, now we're already down to four people. And it's been... It was less than two minutes of gameplay. Less than two minutes of gameplay once again and everyone is gone. Wow. So I can really say that as wow. Now I'm going to start building up on the time because um, this match is going to last a bit longer than normal. Why? Because um, with everyone gone and there's only four people, there's going to be more people to target. And I believe... Actually, no. Um, I would have said I'm the one that has the lowest time. But I don't because... Um, if, um, if I had the lowest time, there would be a red exclamation mark saying that I do have the lowest time. So, it seems I'm doing fine, actually, in terms of my time. Which is surprising, actually, considering I started incredibly slow. And I haven't KO'd anyone. I thought I did KO somebody, but nope. Everyone was just dropping off like flies. And it seems um, that's happened a lot. Like, as I've been playing this a lot, especially in my current sessions, um, deaths are happening like free-fall, to be honest with you. I don't know, like, them, especially in the early doors, at least three people die early. It is so weird just saying that people die so early. You know, like, and I mean proper early. The game, the game barely starts and all I see is three people dying at the very first hurdle. Like, legit dying in front of the Goomba. If you're gonna die in front... If you know you're gonna die in front of the Goomba... On your first try, then power yourself up. Have a mushroom or something, man. Like, it's just a fact. If you know you're gonna die... You have all those co spare coins to use and... Um, you can just use it to um, benefit you. Me, I've always started small because I believe in my ability, but... Like, I can admit, when I first, when I when I um, played the game in my second try, when I got that third place, I did, um, I was guilty enough to use a mushroom. I'm not going to sit here and lie and say that I started small in every, le in every match, because that'd be lying. In my early days of playing this game, um, my first ten games, if I say so, yeah, I started on with mushrooms. So, like, after game two and whatnot, I actually had mushrooms at least for... 15 games in a, for 15 games about just about that but yeah um, majority of my games I have started small and um, like I like I'm going to do here in the farewell tour of Mario 35 I will be um, I will be staying small 
Sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to focus, that's why I'm, I'm, no words appeared out of my mouth, but... Yeah, I'm just trying to focus, because I do want to get as much wins as I can. I feel glad that my um, average rank has improved from um, the beginning. Like, my average rank when I first was playing was 7. And then it's just got better and better, like, it's gone up to... F and then it went up to 4, then 3, then 4... And I think now, um, I haven't looked at my latest ranking, but I'll definitely take being a 3 or 2 as an average rank once this is all over. If I get a 3 or a 2, I can be proud of my performances. But if I um, if my average rank is 1, which it, I doubt, the only reason I say I doubt it will be a 1 is because I've got to win every match to get that average. But um, I'll definitely take being in the top 4 or 3 even. Um, but right now, I think my average... You would say my average ranking is f 2 right now, because I've won twice. Yeah, I won twice. Wait, did I? Yeah, I won twice. Um, in my last uh, video, I won both games. So you like to think my average rank is 2. Oh, look, I've got a spectator. Someone's actually watching. I think it must have been someone that died, because, like, they're still watching. You can see the eye at the bottom of my, of my uh, Mario running thing that it says, one person's watching. I don't know if... I don't know if one person is watching my screen or watching the game. I think they're watching the game because once they die, you can they can still see what's going on on the other screens. Okay, now they're gone. But yeah, people do tend to spectate just to see what happens, which is pretty cool, actually. I've done that once, actually, when I, when I came man, third. I wanted to see how far the final two went. And you know what the funny thing is? When I died and I started looking, they both died, like, right after, which is kind of funny. It's like, if only I survived that much longer, I could have actually been the one that won the match. But, yeah, I'm gonna, I fancy my chances in winning this game, actually. I do. I'm barely getting attacked. This is the one thing that annoys me, actually. So as I'm barely getting attacked, i got to try and accumulate a lot of time. And accumulating time will be impossible sometimes, especially when nobody's attacking you. Okay, now I'm getting attacked because I saw Bowser. There we go, or King Cooper. In this case, he was King Cooper. Well, in this game, in this, in the early days of these games, he was King Cooper. But obviously, we're so used to calling him Bowser now that um, nobody uses the name King Cooper anymore. Okay, we're expecting a Bowser. Told you. And we shrug. Well, we powered down, shall I say? We haven't shrunk yet because. That'll be me. That'll be mean being small. Uh oh. Right there we go. Um, your yeah, time's starting to run down a bit, but it doesn't really matter to me. I don't really feel that much pressure. Pressure? What pressure? Ooh, we should have enough star man, star bright power. <laughs> Give me past the power. Told you it was enough. <laughs> right now it's putting pressure on all of us. Normally the time would run down faster than that. I think it runs faster than that when you, when it gets as it goes along. But either way, I feel no pressure, and I'm not going to. Oh jeez, but I do. I I did um, end up losing my fire flower. Here we go. Sorry, I was concentrating. Star man, star bright. Give me past the power. Give me that flower for an extra fifteen seconds. Just kill everything in my way. Get out of my way. Because I know that... Um, the thing with um, Hammer Brothers... If you leave them alive, they get faster. So when you pass them, they run at a very... Mar they run at max mark speed. No joke. They actually run at super fast speed when, when you run away from them. Because they want to kill you. So they're going to start throwing things your way even faster. God, it's... I don't think we've been on 7-1, actually. I don't think we have. Kill you. I'll skip that flower. I don't really mind. But yeah. Get rid of all the bullet bills that come our way. Uh, don't need that. Oh, hi. Fire flower. Right, let's go. Keep throwing our balls. Eat our fiery balls. That just sounded terrible, if you ask me. Right, that was a bit of a delay, and I think I missed the fire flower, which is right behind me, actually, in the first block. Did he just die? Thank you. 
Right, so the person there that's attacking me ironically has the lowest time. But I'm not really panicking as such because my time's going down, but that doesn't mean my time is up. It means my time is now. I know I just quoted a John Cena fray in John Cena's lyrics, but hey, doesn't matter. Right. If I remember, oh, someone died. Crap, 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 crap. That's Fire Flower gone. Crap, 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 crap. Gotta get a move on, gotta get a move on. See, look, I told you it started chasing me. Legit had, like, some amazing jump speed. And some jumping distance, as if, like, it's Mario. Right. God, I'm under pressure, man. I only say I'm under pressure because, um... Ouch, that's why. But, um, another reason why is because, um, the enemies are starting to rack up on me. There we go. 52 coins. Crap. That's not ideal. 32 coins. Okay, now 52 coins. I'm trying to do this just to get some more time. That's the only reason why, I, um, that's the only reason why you see me use my items and such. Grab that. Right, let's go. Attack you. Come on, let's keep attacking. Just keep on going, keep on going, keep on going, keep on going, keep on going. Sorry, I keep repeating the same thing, same thing, same thing. Either way, just gather up some time. I don't know how much time that person has, but I don't care for it. Oh, he's running out of time. It's, it's flashing. Okay, he's still got some time. His screen was flashing, signaling that his time was running out. Right. I really do need another 20 coins. Duh! No! Okay. Quick, 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 quick. Aha! Hail to the king, baby! Ha ha ha! I had it under wraps, guys. I had it under wraps. Don't worry. You guys must have been panicking saying, oh, he's going down. Nah. I'm a fighter. Not much bonus coins at all. Wow. <laughs> but it feels good to get number three. Number one. Get another W up in this place. Feels good. Yeah. On to the next match. Alright, let's get going. Starting small again. Alright. Let's hope this one will be less less deaths. By that I mean let's hope nobody dies so quickly. Wow. It's been 10 seconds. Never mind. I was about to say, wow, we've got no deaths. Well, the deaths haven't been flat. Okay, now they started flying. I spoke too soon. Because now five people are already gone. See? I spoke too soon. How you? How do people die? No, I still, I still have to say this. How do people die in the first level? It's the easiest level in the game. It legit is the easiest level in the game. How do you die on the first level in the early doors? If you're, if you're really unsecure about everything, you might as well get the, uh, might as well start with a fire flower just to be on the safe side so that you can accumulate time quickly. Of course, um, I have my own strategy. I don't really need to start with a power-up anymore, as I've got more experience playing this game. I just start small and take my time. Like, when the Goomba approaches you, you can screw you could screw up the jump to the point where the Goomba kills you. It hasn't happened to me in this game. I, I, like I said, my worst finish is 15th place. Um, yeah, my worst finish is 15th. Um, so, yeah. My strategy is always to... Um, just wait for the Goombas to appear so that you can get, get um, a higher jump on them. Because if you jump... Sometimes if you jump and you hit the block, sometimes it can screw your day up. So that's why I always choose to wait for the Goomba. As you've seen my strategy... You've seen the way I play so far in this game that I wait for the Goombas to actually, um, you know, come out from under their place. Unless I have a Fire Flower, sometimes kill them or I take that um, sacrificial... Um, power down. I was about to say sacrificial shrinkage, but you're not really shrinking if you um, power down to the mushroom. But yeah, sometimes um, I do make that error, like um, I pound the block and then a Goomba hits me. I do take that sacrificial hit sometimes, um, but um, not all the time. Like, um, it depends on high pressure scenarios, because um, when it gets to the final five, they sometimes, or if it's been long enough, they do tend to 
slow down, the, uh, well not slow down, but quicken the time to make it have less chance of you surviving. Unless you have a lot of enemies on your screen and unless you have that contingency plan. We're going to go to world 3-1 because we haven't been there in a while. Okay, I do like I do like this area. Very generous flower, thank you. Right, if you go down this pipe here, you can get some coins. And you can get a fire flower to get some extra time. That's why I came down here as well, to get some coins. <coughs> oh yeah, and to um, currently be a bit tactical. I say be a bit tactical because um, if a lot of enemies do appear and you're not too sure, they do get away once you enter a pipe. But yeah, I just chose I just chose that route because I needed coins. It benefited me because I did grab the coins and I grabbed the time with the flower. It benefited, okay? Aha! Thank you. Kill you. Kill you. There we go. Kill you. Just grab some extra coins. There we go. Right, so um, I can use my um, item button eight eight times if you count um, 160 so every 20 you can use um, a power up so as you can see this will be nine times I can use it now but I don't really use it until near the end or unless I'm at a castle stage where it's top middle bottom and I get compromised with a lot of enemies I think that ha I think you already saw that happen to me actually but yeah I do tend to waste a lot of items when that happens because sometimes the items you need when you're in a different state, um, like um, a mushroom or something, it doesn't really come your way. Sometimes the power does, but um, I really like to have that insurance policy like a fire flower. Like having that insurance policy for me is always the key to surviving in this game. Oh, of course, and of course the time. You need a lot and a lot of time. There we go. Now we can use the um, items 11 times. I'm not going to keep looking at my coin count because that will just be distracting. Alright, just keep going. We don't really need to get that flower up there because we got 400 seconds already. That will just be a waste of time. Just kill the Hammer Brother. Seems everyone's getting the Hammer Brothers levels. Me, I'm just getting all the regular levels. Oh, hello! Flying Fishies. Or Flying Cheap Cheeps. It's raining cheap cheeps. Hallelujah. Anyway, let's not go into... Li oh, jeez. Stupid cheap cheep. Let's not go into lyrics of a cheap cheep. And I shrink. But well, that's okay. Because that doubles my upgrade. If this was the normal Mario game and you and the fire flower was there, you actually would only get a mushroom. So, yeah. the <laughs> I'm glad they changed that in for just for this game. That you can upgrade to a flower. I think the only time that they started doing that actually was in Super Mario World because in the other Mario games if you do if you're small uh, yeah if you're small in the other Mario games like from um, Mario's 1 to 3 and you got the mush uh, fire flower it wouldn't it wouldn't help you it would actually just give you a mushroom instead I think it's on Super Mario World is when they debuted the whole if you get a cape, you immediately get two power up upgrades instead of just the one. Right, let's do this. Star man, star brag, give us past the power. See, now, now that it's in the latter part of the game, I do use the item box just um, sometimes when I'm, um, you know, sometimes when I'm small. But it's not all the time I do it. It's only here I did because of the fact that. Um, I was small and there was a lot of things on the screen. Right, pick up the fire flower here. Now let's just run and destroy things as we please. Get that time that we lost. <laughs> there we go. Didn't really lose that much time, but hey. Gaining that time to be on 400 is so important. Oh, 4-3. I was about to complain saying if it was 1-3. 4-3 isn't too bad, but 1-3, um, I hate it. I'm not gonna lie. I already told you how much I hate it. Well, in in actual game, like the Mario game itself, I don't mind it, but in this, I do mind it because of the fact that um, 
it's just a hindrance. Like, all the enemies that you want to kill are on the, um, will always walk off. See, like the Goombas there. That's one thing that annoys me. But, um, yeah. Oh, look, an extra power up. I didn't mean to hit the X button, but I did. Either way, thank you. Ah, Hammer Brother. Die. Yeah, Hammer Brothers, you're not welcome in this, on this anyway. Give me pasta power! It's Super Mario! Man, I really need to stop quoting the Super Mario Brothers Super Show so often, but... Hey, it's a cheesy show! Leave me alone! I like it! <laughs> Wait, I'm pretty sure they removed the Mario things off Netflix as well. I'm, I'm not sure. I might be wrong in that aspect, but, um... Thank you. Yeah, I might be wrong in that aspect, but, um... Doesn't really matter. Um, let's just keep going. Yo! <laughs> Yo, video games. I do like video games. Bash your heading and your shell kick you and thanks for the time. Oh look! <coughs> oh wait, it's three people. I'm just gonna wait to kill this hammer brother here. I don't see why not. Or just jump on your head. Gain some extra time. Wow, gain a lot of extra time. If they only just leaves me on 400 seconds, it doesn't really matter. Being on 400 seconds when the time's moving down very fast is a good thing. It always is a good thing. Because you have a bit the edge over your, em over your rivals. Enemies, rivals, I think you still got the point. Right, there we go. Get out of the way. And then there was two. Question is, who's going to win? Me or this guy? Well, I can tell you who's going to win because I have no intention of losing. Me, that's who. Okay, that was... I do like stepping on the um, shell, the shells. Like, big time, anyway. When, when I get the time, I like stepping on them, anyway. Thank you. Attack you. Thank you. Yeah, I'm not in a rush to kill all these enemies. <laughs> I haven't got time to bash my head on the coins and not get a concussion or break my hands. Pasta power. Thank you. Hail to the king, baby. Told you I wasn't ready to die. I got no KOs there again. You don't really have to KO anybody to win. You just need to focus on yourself most times. If you get a KO... It's natural that you do get KOs and you do take other people's coins when you beat them and you get a lot of time. KOs can be very essential, but um, I wouldn't always count on getting KOs. You always got to count on yourself. So, yeah, another win. And, of course, we're going to continue our battles in the next video.